Hello folks, it's Larry Hawks from Saving Local History again. I received this box in the mail, I think it was three weeks ago today. I've just been so busy doing other things and you know, still a little weak from having COVID and so far, I've not even opened it yet. So I'm going to open it up and show you my new tool. I need it open. Got part of that box open. So here's a receipt from Fort Bedford Metal Detectors. So I don't know exactly what this is. Let's see. It does say paid though. Get that out of the way here. And your styrofoam. Get the box out of the way. In the well, folks, got my hands on XP Deus 2. It took a while. I got on the list early, but I went in the I guess the elite group that got them months early. Actually, this detector, you know, I watch a lot of YouTube. I mean, I watch a whole lot of YouTube, probably too much. And I believe this is a detector that put the YouTube world in a frenzy. I'd say there's a couple hundred thousand videos already on uh, XP Deus. I'm sure there's 50 or 60 or 75 or 100 unboxing videos, but I figured I'd just add my little presentation to the course. I don't know very much about the detector. I just know I've got the original XP Deus and I've bought a whole lot of other detectors over the years and still got a lot and I just love to learn. So let's see what's in here. Oh boy. Looks good. I'll hide behind the box. I'll see over here on the side and see what it is. Well, start with, I'll start at the bottom. This is a lower shaft. It does have some numbers on it. It pretty well looks close to identical to the original XP days. Then we got the stem. That looks about the same, so it's got a real nice rubber grip on it. I really like that. Telescopic. Still got the little Cam locks that will pinch you very good if you're not careful. But it looks good. So what do we got here? Looks like we've got, the, I guess you call it the control box. I guess that's a hip mounted case. That's real nice. Just stick it on your hip arm. If you need to set something, open it up. See if we can get it out and look at it. we can. Hard to get out. Got a little nub on the back of it. Right. Well, that's a handy little case. And there's a new unit. Control unit. Feels nice. I think it's waterproof to like 65 feet or something. That's real nice. I really like that. A little bit bigger than the original as I said. Then I guess this is the headphones or the back phones. Yes, that's the WS6. Like I say, I'm not much of a fan of these back phones. I've actually made or adapted two or three of my headphones to work with. I hope it'll still work with this one. Well, it looks like it's about the same. I'll find out later. That, uh, that works real good. And I guess this is a water kit. Of course with wireless detector, you can't get a sound from the cold to the control unit unless you've got it wired. So this is to do that for diving and you know, wading and so forth. I probably won't be using that very much, but here it is in case I decide to. And here's another value. So like I said, this is going to be a real quick unboxing if you can find all the details online in many places. 
There's an arm strap. That's a charging clip. Appears to be the same as the old one. It's really tight. USB cable. A lot of people have trouble with these breaking, so I bought a couple extra when I bought my original XP Days. And I've treated them pretty rough and they're still working fine, so hopefully this is my third one. Looks like another USB cable. I guess to charge the control unit. And I'm sure this is just the charger. Just a Just another USB charger. Like a little lanyard for the control box. And it looks like you get the two bolts and washers and nuts for the coil. And this is the thing that's totally amazing. Unbelievable manual. Nice color manual. And that's a that's a Excellent manual. I bought a detector. Actually, the last detector I bought had no paperwork whatsoever with it. No manual, no instructions, you know, no receipt, nothing. You had to go online, and there's nothing even in the box to tell you to go online. You had to figure that out yourself. Not with XP Days, they got you covered. Now, the last piece, probably buried here in the bottom. Ended up with 11 inch coil. This fast multi frequency coil with uh, goes from 4 to 45 kilohertz. Of course, I'll definitely be getting the 11 inch, I mean the 9 inch. This is 11 inch. I'll be getting the 9 inch eventually and probably the uh, 11 by 13 when it comes out. So, this is it. This is what I've been waiting for. It's not like I needed another detector or anything. I, you know, I really like XP Days when they came out. Shut the box up here. Really like the other XP Days, but main reason I wanted this one was, of course, I love a challenge. I like something new, and I like multi-frequency, and I think they've probably done an excellent job with this if it's like anything else they've done. But one of the main reasons is, if you watch my last video, I'm finally getting the age that I've got to hit some of these real hard to get two sites that I've found over my lifetime. It's probably dozens and dozens of them. It's going to take a lot of hiking and so forth. Well, I wanted this because it is all wireless, modular, and it's waterproof. And I can put it in a backpack and not have a lot of weight and so forth. Get to where I'm going and have a top-of-the-line detector to use. So that's the main reason I want it. So. Uh, Anyway, that's my quick unboxing. I know it didn't take long, it didn't cover much, but just wanted to show you I had a new tool. I'd like to thank you for watching my videos and for subscribing to my channel. And if uh, nothing happens, I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.